ocean and I hear the roar of an engine beside me and I start thinking where could this guy possibly be going when there's a parked vehicle there and then I see him jump up onto the curb. I see this van just start taking people out, bodies flying everywhere. The last person I saw was a girl by the name of Anne Marie and uh, I immediately jumped out of my van and, and ran to be by her side and uh, I just I held her hand and tried to reassure her that everything was going to be okay. I called 911. I waited and waited and it seemed like eternity for paramedics to get there. They finally came and uh, it was just chaos. People were running everywhere, screaming, just everything. It was just insane. I did what I could and unfortunately the first name I heard today was hers passing away and I was hopeful that she was going to survive. I thought it was just a mistake, a bad dream, you know, just I couldn't believe it. I just couldn't believe what was happening and I just just kept wondering why, what's, what's going on here? Like, then I'm looking to see where that van came to a stop and I heard people saying he's gone he's gone he took off he took off and then I started to think he, maybe he took off because he was scared or something it, it couldn't be that somebody would do this deliberately to hurt innocent people I, I brushed the hair away from her face and just stayed the whole time with her I mean, at one point, I felt like I was going to pass out. I was just, I, maybe just in shock, or I don't know what it was. And then they finally, we lifted her up onto the stretcher, and, and they took her away. And that's, that's it. I took a sleeping pill last night to try and sleep, because I just kept replaying everything in my head. And I could still couldn't sleep. And every chance I got, I was Googling her name, and trying to Facebook and see if I could find who she is or her parents or somebody that obviously loves and cares about her and just to let them know that, you know, even though she passed, she didn't pass alone. And I don't know if that's any comfort to anyone when you've lost someone that you love. But that was all that I could do.